Moto Nation, welcome. Today I'm on location in downtown Deerfield Beach, Florida. Welcome to another episode of the Downtown Hopper. On location today in the city of Deerfield Beach. And uh, this is one of my favorite little downtown spots, a nice little seaside community here in uh, Broward County, Deerfield Beach. So we're going to poke around the downtown area, head up the pier, and of course the beach. Alright, walking down the famous A1A. Um, it's got this little curvy area right here. Um, there's a parking garage out there, but... I never used the parking garage. I parked in the street. There's metered parking. So heads up on that. Um, that's about it. Uh, do you feel, and uh, usually you got a lot of bikers out here, which is a cool little spot if you want to catch some motorcycles. Um, a little quiet today, but uh, usually there's a ton of bikes rolling through here. But then again, it is a little bit early. It's just uh, past 7 o'clock a.m. So about 7.30 a.m. Current temperature 86 degrees on July the 30th of 2022. Last Saturday of July 2022. I love these little seaside communities, you know, like. If you haven't noticed, I like being by the water. <laughs> I got a lot of videos out, a lot of beach videos and stuff, and seaside communities, downtown areas, sun rising out there, uh, the Atlantic Ocean's out that way. We got a 7-Eleven coming up on the right hand side, and I believe there's like a little surf shop as well over here. Um, uh, water sports, and uh, over here, there's a a uh, place I came once before that has a uh, cold brew coffee and it was really good. So I'm hoping to, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is the place with the shark on it. It's got a big giant shark up there. And uh, they got some scooters here. Uh, for rent. Yeah. That'd be cool. I was thinking about getting an uh, e-bike though, man. I've been uh, shopping around for one lately. And uh, this spot right here got some really good iced coffee. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, pretty cool. We pan around this way and uh, we start walking in this direction. Uh, still on A1A. A1A is a little weird because it like twists and turns and winds around and gets all crazy. Um, and uh, it merges with US1 sometimes and then sometimes it's on one side in a coastal, sometimes it's on the other. Alright, looking both ways, crossing the street, good to go. Alright. Brews room right here. I've seen a couple of them down in South Florida. I think it's like a sports pub uh, kind of thing. They got a little uh, little outdoor uh, dining area right here. So there's public parking out this way, but I haven't really ventured out in that direction. Um, but the parking garage, we were actually right next to it. Um, this whole structure here is part of the parking garage. So a lot of downtown areas in Florida have, for the most part, paid parking or some kind of parking facility, at least West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale Beach. Uh, Miami, I'm not too sure. I've never driven to Miami. I've always taken the train down there. <laughs> so I always take the train when I go to the city, that's for sure. All right, that's some clouds hanging around hanging out up there. There's uh, one big rain cloud in the vicinity, but I would say mostly 
hotly sunny today. So, uh, yeah, so 86 degrees and it's just about 7.30. So, yeah. It's gonna be a hot one today. Oh man, yep. I went out power walking yesterday, actually on Thursday, and I could swear the sun was right next to me the whole time. Yeah, hot, sticky summer in Florida. I love it though. I know it sounds like I'm complaining, but I'm really not. <laughs> of A1A, also known as Ocean Avenue and uh, South Northeast 1st Street. And if you swing around this way, is the public parking coming up on the right-hand side is the entrance just past these trees. So, you know, and public park, I, I like the paid parking, man, you know. At night, sometimes it can be a little crazy. It depends on where you are, but uh, during the day, and uh, there you go, the Deerfield Beach paid parking facility. <laughs> Excitement at every corner. Now, if I head down this way, it's gonna bring us down to the intercoastal. We're in between the intercoastal and the ocean right here. Coming up on these apartment buildings called the penthouse straight ahead. Man, if this, doesn't scream typical Florida uh, scenery right here, you know, like definitely tropicale, <laughs> you know, it's like uh, almost feels like you're in Hawaii, <laughs> but uh, yes, the tropics right here, well, subtropics technically, <laughs> and the uh, intercoastal right behind. It is building, but we're gonna head back out to A1A in Hillsboro, and then I'm gonna check out the beach and the pier, and uh, have some good times. Thank you everybody for watching all my videos. Downtown videos always seem to be doing good. They're like the best performing ones um, so far. And this is called the Downtown Hopper here on the all new Manny Moto One Vlog Adventures, home of the Downtown Hopper, the Beach Hopper, the Road Runner, and the Beer Review Show. Right here, Manny Space Moto, space the number one. All right. be cool to live in a neighborhood like this right on the beach you know I guess the one thing you have to be concerned with is hurricanes and stuff um, you know uh, I guess they probably evacuate everybody when a big one rolls in um, and of course uh, hey man prayers I got to the folks in Kentucky man at the time of this recording Kentucky man got hit with some big time flooding man watching it on the news and that's some serious stuff so I've never been to Kentucky before, man. Uh, should put it on my to-do list. So yeah, I mean, uh, we've had hurricanes up in New York, Hurricane Gloria, Hurricane Sandy, the big two. So yeah, so I'm assuming they have to evacuate. I mean, the water's like right, pretty close. So and uh, but I guess that's. What you gotta deal with when you live in uh, in paradise. So this, is, I don't think what street this is, but we're coming back to uh, A1A, which is straight ahead. And then uh, I just go ahead up to the pier. I think they charge two dollars to get onto the pier. If I remember from last time, and uh, maybe check out the beach. Beautiful. Look out! Look how beautiful. That sky is right there, you know. I still, I love coming out early in the morning. Like the nighttime videos are all right, you know. Um, but the morning videos, I have to say, are my favorite. <laughs> I have confessed it. And uh, 
This is a cool little neighborhood. And apparently they had deer here at one time. I think that's why they call it Deer Field. <laughs> uh, but I have not seen any deers yet. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, we now head to the pier. And then Hillsborough Road, I stopped for some iced coffee and buy some stickers. Stick around because our adventure continues. Just a heads up, I have a separate video of just the beach for an upcoming beach hopper video. Here we are now at the Deerfield Fire Station 75 on the corner of South Ocean Way and Southeast 1st Street. And I found another parking lot. Uh, Southeast 1st Street off of A1A and uh, by the firehouse. All right, so I got this new microphone. Let me uh, know how it works. All right, continuing on now towards the famous A1A. Uh, man, I would like to uh, drive A1A down to Miami, but I don't know if that would be suicidal <laughs> to do that. <laughs> I never actually uh, driven in Miami before. Uh, I've ridden to Miami with my cousin to the airport in Miami uh, twice, and it was an adventure both times. I'm gonna cross over this way. I look both ways, nobody's coming, and we are good to go. Yeah, so I'm holding the mic in my hand, man, because uh, I think like the wire on the old mic got messed up or something. Sometimes it would record, sometimes it wouldn't. And uh, I'm using like the headphone jack, so I gotta make sure when I plug it in that I hear the little click. So I know for a fact that it's plugged in, you know. Uh, eventually I'm gonna probably just go wireless in due time, but you know. You gotta build an empire on a budget, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, oh, check this out. We got this cool looking car right here. Um, also, another place I've been seeing, uh, this place called Wings, which uh, I guess is a chain franchise as well. They sell like old beachwear and stuff. Um, I got one coming up on the corner here. I was hoping to uh, get another sticker today, but I don't know if they open yet. All right, we continue on now. <laughs> There's a lot of bikers on A1A. That's the one thing to look out for when y'all driving down A1A. Bikers are all over the place. And uh, some of the signs dictate you gotta be like three feet away from them. You gotta watch all the signs too, so it could be a little tricky. So, uh, <laughs> and uh, we all know when you're driving that bike riders can be a little bit aggravated. <laughs> I said it, I said I said it. Uh, I parked over here on Northeast 1st Street. Uh, you can see my SUV all the way down there. So this is where I parked, we got some street parking here. This apartment building right here. The fucking year. Oh. Fancy. If that doesn't scream 1950s Florida, man. <laughs> I love these old buildings, man. I love these old Florida buildings. It's like, you just know, like, this was here back in the beginning when the Florida boom started and, you know, all the snowbirds started moving down here and whatnot. But I just love that old school Florida architecture. Oh, yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and while you're here, stop by at Killwin's, get yourself some ice cream, man. This place is so good. Um, I had them once down in Del Rey. They got a location down there, and I had chocolate uh, and chocolate chip. It was so good. Uh, they do, like, fudge ice cream and stuff, so, yeah, they're all over. I see them all over the place. Ooh, they are open. Oh, let's see if I can get a sticker.
coffee, cold brew, four dollars, delish, and stickers. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, today's Deerfield Beach excursion is in the books. Thank you for stopping by today. This is Manny for Manny. Manny. Thank you.